do y'all see my hair? Do y'all see my eyebrows? Yeah, girl. Welcome to a maintenance vlog. Welcome back to another vlog. If you're new here, I'm Candace. Welcome to my channel. While you're here, go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell and we'll get right into the video. Today's video is obviously a maintenance vlog. I'm I'm going on vacation, so I'm getting my hair done, eyebrows done, just got done getting a pedicure, and I'm getting my nails done tomorrow. So I'm taking y'all along with me to like pick up some little toiletries and stuff that I need for that. So yeah, girl, just stay tuned. from me getting my nails done and picking those items up from Target. I am getting my hair done in the morning so of course I gotta wash and like blow dry my hair tonight. This is the result of me going to Six Flags and like having a puff. Yeah y'all. So yeah I'm so glad I'm getting my hair done in the morning. <laughs> washing my hair and I did not do my full wash routine because honestly it is 10:49 at night and I'm tired like this is your sign not to procrastinate right here if you needed a sign this is your sign not to procrastinate because I'm tired and I feel like I'm about to regret not doing my full wash routine because I didn't even really detangle oops so I don't see how long it takes me to blow dry my hair. So I'm starting at 1050. We gonna see how long it takes to, for me to blow dry my hair. <laughs> section like section off my hair blow dry this one section so mm, I don't know it might not take that long that feeling you get when you get to your last and final section whoop, 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 whoop. drying my hair 
there. It is currently 11.42 p.m. And so each section took me about like 15 minutes or so. So I guess not bad on timing, but I could have did this earlier in the day so I don't feel tired. But anyway, y'all. I guess it's been a while since I actually stretched out my hair because I don't remember my hair being that long and I don't know if I'm gonna have a problem tomorrow with getting my oh I guess I never told y'all what I was getting but I'm getting full locks so I originally scheduled for 24 inches but then I was talking to like Fallon and Brittany about it and it was like girl that's gonna be touching the back of your thighs so I was like okay so I asked um, the stylist if I can change it to 18 and she was like mm, I think your hair is longer than 18 inches and I was like no I don't think so um yeah I don't know mm, I don't know hopefully there isn't any problems with it being 18 inches tomorrow we gonna cross our fingers. <laughs> but good night y'all, I'ma see y'all in the morning. I don't mean to put it on your nose, but it's clear. How my baby's running this the block, cause you fear what you do to you if you get dirty hands in the near. What you do, what she is, little boy, I tell you this. If baby wants to sit, she can sit. Is it true you actually think of me as less than you? Less than you. Just wish that I Something like that could happen Maybe it's just in passing Cause nothing is everlasting, no But like really though How do you know that I can overcome All of the obstacles she just looked me I'm getting my eyebrows done So I'm showing y'all after I did go to Target the other day, but I forgot to get sunscreen, so I need to go back. And then I want to go to Sephora so I can get like a, a tinted moisturizer or like a BB cream instead of wearing foundation in Vegas. That's my first time telling y'all where I'm going. <laughs> but yeah, y'all, I'm going to Vegas. Um, It's going to be hot. Like, I think it's 115 degrees right now in Vegas. So, wearing makeup is probably uh, not the best idea because it's just going to sweat off. But, like, when we go out at night, I do want to have a little bit of something to, like, make my skin tone even. So, I want to do, like, a tinted moisturizer or a BB cream. So, that's what I'm going to do. Um, or I'm going to at least try to look at go to Sephora and look at some stuff there. 
So, yeah, y'all, just just keep up, stay tuned. I came here to get the Black Girl sunscreen, but apparently they're discontinuing it, so I went with the Hawaiian Tropic. And hopefully it doesn't leave a white cast on me, because you know how sunscreen, you know how sunscreen does. Did y'all know that the Sephora inside JCPenney was shutting down, and that JCPenney was going to have their own beauty line? Because I didn't know that. So I wasted my time coming all the way to JCPenney, because it's the closest Sephora near me. And they had absolutely nothing. Everything was like being sold out and they're not restocking anything because obviously they're closing now. But like, why y'all ain't tell me? <laughs> anyway, so I guess I'm just going to take whatever foundation that I have at home and just use that. And maybe I'm just going to use foundation when we're going out at night. And that's it. Because wearing makeup all day in the heat is not for me. I haven't eaten since this morning. It's currently 4.11 and I am hungry and I need some caffeine because I know I'm going to stay up all night like trying to get my stuff together and like packing and folding clothes and all that good stuff. So I'm going to probably get a salad from Chick-fil-A and then go to Starbucks. I should have said no cherry. Uh, dang it. I don't really like the peach chunks in it, but it's good. So it's my first time having a pineapple pineapple refresher from Starbucks. Ah, I don't like it. It's like it's not sweet. Ugh. You know, I usually specify to make it with lemonade, and I didn't do that. So maybe they. I don't know, but that ain't good. <laughs> Basically all my maintenance is done. Now I just have to pack. So I'm going to do that with y'all in a little bit, but right now I'm just going to eat my salad and then I'll catch back up with y'all when I'm ready to pack. I did want to tell y'all my bad experience at the nail salon when I was getting my pedicure. So of course, like I had to get my nails soaked off because I was going to somebody else to get my nails done. So, while I was getting my pedicure, you know, I was like, I want to get my nails soaked off. And it was her co-worker sitting right next to me, not doing anything on her phone. So, the lady that was doing my pedicure was like, hey, do you want to do a takeoff? And the lady was like, you know, she said, yeah, whatever. And then she came over, snatched my hand, snatched my hand. And started using like a nail clipper to like clip my nails off. And I said, no, 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 no. I want to soak off because these are my real nails. I want to soak off. And she was like, I'll keep your real nails. I'll keep your real nails. And she proceeds to try to clip my nails off. And I said, no, I want a soak off. And she got mad. Threw all her utensils down. And just proceeds to sit back down. So I'm like, what? And so the lady that was doing my pedicure got up and like got the materials to soak my nails off. And she just ended up doing it. And I'm like, how rude is that? Because you wanted to be on your phone. Like, I get it. Like, if you were on break and you don't feel like doing anything, I get it. But like, that's not how you treat customers. So... I don't know about going, like, I'll go to nail salons to get my pedicure, but I don't know if I'm going to get my nails done at nail salons anymore because y'all can't keep treating us with this bad customer service and thinking we're going to still show up. Like, no. And I'm tired of it. These nail salons are really getting out of hand. So, I just want to hop back on and tell y'all my nail experience. Hey, girl. It's currently... 1 22 a.m and i'm just not feeling like i'm getting my life together to go to the airport i'm planning on waking up at 5 a.m because britney's coming over to my house at 6 15 ish so we can be to the airport by 7 7 30 because our flight leaves at 10. and 
<sighs> yeah. I'm going to be exhausted. But I feel like I got my life together. So, I was going to do like a whole pack with me. But y'all y'all know I, I procrastinate. So, at that point, I was just trying to pack everything so I can be ready to go. It's Like I said, it's almost 1.30 a.m. I'm waking up at 5. So, sorry y'all for not doing the pack with me. But I hope y'all enjoyed this video. And I'll see y'all in Vegas.